Wow, wow, wow. Hey there, everyone. This is Zao Gal playing Metal X3. We're going in the apartment building of festivals and probably gonna play one level. Magal X3 featuring Spookter. Yeah, this just looks like the hallway of an apartment building, which is really awkward. Play. Yeah, just these the, these two one day at a time, and this is probably gonna be because they're done it's see. Oh, it's one. I don't know. I guess, I guess it depends on how things go. Today, Star Knight, 58th place, Tempestuous Reservoir. Relatively even score distribution. And uh, we get eaten. And then we're gonna see what happens. There's a second star, but it's probably like a bonus thing. Like that's been the trend lately. All right, check it out, that rain. We got conflicting rain molecules and trees. Conflicting tree molecules. Look at that guy down there. This is kind of bobbing, flopping. There's a broken, broken bridge. It's not broken at all. Uh-huh, uh, it doesn't matter. This blast storm and construction of the dam anyway, so I guess I can spare some time for you, okay. Uh, okay, Torque Foreman of Beetle Dam Project. Okay, a couple of months ago to build a dam. Alright. Okay. That's possible to get any work done. The whole place is swamped. And now we got rain monsters are just coming in. Alright. I uh, scratch my back. And I'll scratch your shell. Investigate the area. Kill as many monsters as you can. Clear away some debris. And I'll see what. Okay, okay, okay. Give you corners how the place works. Alright. Twice the concept. Oh, so okay. So you can speak to these guys. Uh, careful, indoor. I've become incredibly flooded. Swim your way through. Yeah, I. It's okay. I don't need to breathe. Breathing is for suckers. Uh, for that fish. All right. So we got fish and crab. Huh? Yeah. Hey, this already. Like in terms of flavor, this place is kind of wonderful. I uh, like. There's this like pool like filter over everything, so it does feel kind of murky. Got a slightly different Mario, we got crates just kind of being there. Let's go. Alright, I'm gonna open these boxes and get a prize of some kind. I think it's gonna be like fire something to destroy all these enemies around? Well, maybe not, maybe it won't. I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. See? Alright, I'm gonna take the time. No, I'm gonna take the subtle hint that I might want to destroy a couple of couple of monsters around. There's an angry blog there, like maybe that's some kind of indication that something is afoot in Marlboro Town. Alright, look at that little pipe there. Don't don't worry about it. It's a decor thing. These fish are running away from my fire rain balls of fire. That's right, that crab is no more. We have found a dead end in evolution. Alright, so it's not took the time to because you know, you know, it's just, that's what the foreman was like. It's like, hey, you know, enemies are in the way, some debris, maybe Debra, you know, gotta find her pancake collection. It's all those things. Oh look at that, it was an emergency block a phone. That's why the block was angry, because it was a fish in it. Blocks hate hand fish. So I didn't get any sort of indication that anything was done, but I don't know. That's the reality of it. Oh, it's raining here underwater. Don't think about it too much. It's okay. We got lines kind of spread around, spreading everywhere, all over town. Yeah. Uh, uh. So far. All right. So here we can get out of the water. That's pretty wild. We can also get down here if you want to get some money. There's spikes someone put down here, and I'm going to... Ooh, look at that, we got uh, electrode problems. Alright, might need to find the electrode switch, or maybe like, just find some bleach we can toss in their direction. That'll make them run away. That fish never flew out of his box. What about that box? It just happened. Alright, I'm gonna get these monies to unclog this one water supply here. I don't know, I'm not taking a red coin. Whoosh, did a, a red coin gave me 10 points. These guys just keep respawning. So I can't get rid of world of those. Uh, pickle! Eight red coins, my friend, the other side of the dam. My, oh, 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 okay. All right. Sure, my friend, we're willing to reward. Okay, so it might be an eight red coin challenge. You just flat out said it's a red, okay, never mind. Uh, Alright, so red coin search. 
Uh, I don't know how big the level is. That's not a door you can enter. It's a door you can experience. Experience opening doors. It's the wild ride of the Everglades. All right, Roscoe. So down there we got, we got another Jellicrode. Just had an Jellicrode party. Pretty rude, cause I wasn't invited. Get out of here, plant. Yeah, that's right. Destroy the world. Where'd that fire come from? It was a fire somewhere thrown by someone with a fire ability. Okay, I see that switch. Yeah, hit it and you'll lower the water level. Hit it again, you'll raise it back. All right. All right, so I'm kind of stuck in where I'm going, so now I'm going to do that, and then the jellyfish goes away. All right, so we got a wet-dry sort of situation. Make it dry, make it fly. Still can't enter that door. Got anything to say about the beach? Pickles! I love talking with strangers about pickles. It's the only way I can breathe. All right, so... Because, yeah, jellyfish, you know, if they're not in the water, they just kind of explode. And that crab, when he's on fire, he's dead. Well, that's a Goomba. That's a guy with fire in his face. Eh, nope, wrong button. All right, you know what, it's fine. Sometimes accidents like that happen because I'm not careful enough. Ridiculous, I'm aware. Look at that Goomba. Uh, that's right. So, ooh, okay, so we got just like that wacky wheeler type of enemy here. Just like this big old snail. A big old spike ball for a shell. There's red coin too, assuming there's not any in the early part of the level before you know that you're looking for them. I mean, it's possible. You can go back, which, you know, might not necessarily mean anything. Water loop, excellently. Ooh, fish. All right, I'm gonna try and fry it. There you go. Can't fry a bullet though, that would be ridiculous. All right, so I'm thinking that. We're gonna be, like, hitting a switch to raise the water level or something. I don't know, I don't know where I got such a silly idea here. I don't know how my imagination came up with that concept. Look at this ground here. Yeah, that's right, it's dirt. Everyone likes dirt, especially when it flies over the earth. Uh, but yeah, I cannot really do anything here yet, so maybe the water rise is gonna happen over here, huh? How about that? I don't know. Fish in a box. Fish in... Whoa. In a delivery. Fish delivery. That fish died. Uh, poor specimen of misunderstanding. Alright. Get bullets. Is that part of the dam construction? Or is that the monsters settling in? Or is this, you know, we got, we got bullet bills. Yeah. Can you go in here? Doesn't look like it. Yay, water. Alright. We got more water now. Look at that, see? Yeah, I could tell it would be water rise. Just why would it be water fall? Don't know such thing. Uh-oh, please go down. Thank you. Yeah, that ladder kind of threw me off. Alright, here we go. Fish destruction! I'm very happy that I have a fire flower. Like, I feel like it changes how you experience a level like this quite a lot, so... I feel like it's important that I, I keep this going as for as long as I can. They're swimming. That's cute. Alright, so I'm thinking you need to go up there to do the level. Oh, but I can go back there, but there's a... Okay, maybe we'll find a way to go around? Hope so. Because there's red money. Gotta get that red money. Yes, I can. I'll be able to do that. Alright, hey, plant death. The death of plants. Also known as something. There's probably a scientific word for it. Look at that log. Yeah, have a log and good time. All these jellyfish that live here. That's pretty crazy. All right, so careful, 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 careful. Those crates in the background, you know, they're still doing fine. They're doing, they're having a great time. All right, so underwater rain. So, you know, don't think about it. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. Shoot. All right, well, I'm significantly weaker now. I can't go there. Uh, suddenly you'll see that my playstyle might change drastically. All right, there's a key somewhere, by the way, if you want to go there. All right, da, 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 boo. Boss Torque made us sell log blocks. Okay, can't have just, yeah, 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 yeah. The only way to open them is with special key. Storeroom. Flooded. Alright, and I've been there, and I've been down. Fireball heading my way at great speed. 
can't help but feel that like um man so the issue is that if there's a if there's a midpoint I feel compelled not to take it because that means I might have to oh thank you I might have to well I'm gonna have to replay anyways to get all the red coins right all right let's head in a direction and dodge around the fish I can't go there though because there's rocks anywhere. Okay, but there's that there, so switch somewhere. Got it. Switches are good. Hit those. And they interact with the environment. Ah, see, look at that. There's a switch. I solved a puzzle. On my own. Didn't even need to look it up in the wiki that does not exist. That's fortunate. Get out of here, blooper. This is shell violence. We got, you know, just the leftover shells of the dam workers here. Just kinda chillin'? I don't know. Don't think about it too much. Hey, look at that. I destroyed this brick using a shell that was abandoned somehow, somewhere. Watch out for spikes. There's no, like, counter to tell me at what level of red coin I am at right now, and that's a little stressful. But at the same time, like, would that really help me? I mean, I don't know. Hey, there's a key, by the way. Is it a special key? It looks like a pull tab. Yeah, I did. I threw it upward at a slight angle, and... And I destroyed the squid. Whoosh. Dang it. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to use you here to open the way for me. Should I bring a shell with me? Like, what if it's useful? Well, I'm gonna have to be hauling this key here, so so this is a fish, it's fine. Fish exists, this may come as a shock. Uh, I know a lot of people have been trying lately on the news to deny the existence of fish, but no! They're around, they exist! Just look in the water once, and you'll be shocked by what you find. Alright, hey, look at that, we're here. Got myself a big gray key and a fireball heading my way. I'm gonna jump right in that guy. That was kinda lame. Um, my end. See. Oh, do I want the midpoint? This place has been dangerous, been hit by lightning. Since we made it, probably still be careful. Don't get sued, it gets fried by a straight bolt. And there's also mean fish. But see, the thing is, the flag will make me big. You know what? Look, I can erase midpoint, so I take this for the beginning, and if I die, I'm going to just erase the midpoint. Like, I think that's just the simplest way to get things done. I'm go oh, that guy's gonna spew fire, right? That's not- no, okay, it's just a lava lotus, don't worry. Ah, oh, jeez. Well, okay. I can go in here and maybe not do anything, or maybe- okay, so here, here there's water. The issue is that, uh, is this where the level continues? Or were there things more to the right? I have to find out. Alright, and I'm doing that in a way where I'm not hitting the switch in case it matters. You gotta be careful with levels that ask you to explore because this may impact the player experience when there's ambiguity like this. Well, I guess we're gonna find out. Alright, that fish is having fun. He jumped once. Here we got cannons. See, I don't know. Now, ooh, ice flower. I hope I can keep that going, because that's pretty good. Oh man, I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, commit violence. Coin, coin. Alright, not too exciting. That's a bomb. I did it. Hey, that guy. Proof of concept. Goomba death. Yeah, this is just continuing. Oh, jeez. I- Whoa, 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 whoa. So wait, you need a bomb to go. Uh, alright. Just long enough. Alright. This is feeling more and more light level, though. Uh, I- I'm- I'm keeping going. Knowing full where that I'm probably gonna regret it. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, this is the part where bombs come out. You can't go there, though. You can't go where bombs come from. Ridiculous. You're not a bomb, Mario. Culture bomb. Yeah, this is... 
I am, this is a level, right? Okay, I need to go back. At this point, I need to go back. What am I doing? Oh, All right, so what is here exactly? I don't know. So you can make these guys go away. Uh-huh. Then you can't really do much of anything. All right, so I think what you want to do is you put a shell up there, then you raise a the water, then the jellyfish, then, uh, well, I didn't expect that to despawn. Huh. All right, so that's enough to make despawn. Fair enough. Then I'm gonna kick that. It's gonna get stuck in there. And then I can just remove the water? Like, is it that simple? I don't know. I guess we're gonna find out. So you get here. Then, yeah, like, it bounces around here. It's fine. Then it's gonna plop, plop, fluke. And then it's gonna hit that switch. So you did it, I guess. Then you just raise back up. I don't know if I'm gonna need that shell anymore. But then, you yeah, you raise that back up. Okay, let's see. There's stuff here. Ugh, scary. Alright, uh, I wish I had taken the shell. Let's bring it with me here. Ah, uh, yeah, this was the bonus all along. Alright, I'm gonna go back through the level now. Who knows? Glad to have met you today. Alright, yeah, there's that pipe construction. That I don't know why that's what made me decide to double back. Alright, I can press that blue switch if I want. Uh, oh, it's because, uh... It's, uh, it's a switch you press in the, the other side of midpoint. So it's in case you die and respawn in the midpoint. That's when that becomes relevant. Or there's a big complicated something going on here. All right, so destruction of some. It's pretty fun. We've got like some clogs coming out, out of the grass here, coming out of the pipe. I kind of said the order of those words wrong. That's fine. It's gonna happen sometimes, you know? I mean, there's a lot of plans clogging up all of this pipe network. Like, honestly, I don't know if there's much I can do to help you out, guys. There we go. See, then you do... See, so that's just to make sure that you have to go through the loop here. Alright, duck. Standing in the corner of nothing. Whoosh. That's right. Just say that's right sometimes. It'll make you feel important. All right, well, here we go through a passage of night and day. Whoops, all right, so again, you can travel back through the level, which I think is scary, but it's normally good when you're doing a level where you might want to explore a little bit. I Made mean, it this far. Uh, inside of this dam is pretty close. You'll find a gold star there. Boss Turtle does he didn't want that trinket, all right? He locked it behind the log block. Need to find a key first, should be around this area. And anyway, I need to get the water down because we ain't going down that lock. Go down. Hey, look at that. Get another power up. It's me! I got a power up freeze! Uh, ooh, jeez. Alright, so be careful, the northern mushrooms. That's wild. Alright, you can do that. You can put water back on. Like, there is room for complexity here. We don't know if it's necessary, though. Alright, glad that could happen. Well, let's just commit some amount of violence here as I explore. This is as far as I'm gonna get here without water. There's another green switch there that I cannot press until I activate that. But again, like, you know, we're doing things rationally here, exploring things one step at a time, so that's why I would want a green switch press to get here for whatever reasons that may be. <sighs> Enemies respawn when they are in block form. I keep not remembering that. It's pretty wild. I can get here without activating anyone's trap cards. There you go. Let's destroy a couple of guys, you know, in the neighborhood. No good. All up the death zone. Hope I don't regret this one. Yeah, okay, I can return. Good to know. Let's look around here. There's a thunderstorm going on. Be careful. Goomba death. Alright, there's a Ready Freddy right here. There we go. Another pipe that gets down. Let's check that out real quick. Yeah, it leads us to the end, uh, possibly. 
So look at that. We got ourselves a kumquat machine. It's a machine that builds kumquats. I don't know how it works. Gene splicing. That's what's all the rage now. Squid. Squid is scary. So I'm gonna carry it in pog form. Alright, so I'm gonna do that. Because it sounds like the right thing to do. And I'm gonna go down here, huh? You see? You see that? He just exploded in my hands. Had a good time. Alright, here, we can go here. I press the switch without really meaning to. And it's fine, because once there's water rain, you can go there all you want. And that's what it's all about. Bake a pie with fresh ingredients of meringue and death. Alright? What does that mean? Does it matter? It never did. So, obviously, at some point, you can go up. Oh, not here, though. Wait. Yeah, is there a way to force this down? Alright, so don't go here yet. Alright, um, I saw a springboard somewhere. That might be relevant. Alright, so with Kentucky now exiled to the Sacrifice Zone... Ah, shoot! I feel naked now. I feel so vulnerable. Alright, well, if I die, I'll be mad. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> like... Alright, what's over here? It's, okay, it's just a fish. Yeah, see here, this local springboard asks for forgiveness. You can swim with it. Alright, had I realized that, I would have explored in the right direction, but... You know, that's what makes an exploration-based level worth playing. It's when you don't know what's the right direction, and you might go in the wrong way. Yeah, that's what it's uh, stuck in just that going upward fable there, so yeah. Knock it down, please. Look at that, I got a large Mario 1 springboard! It always looks so big compared to like Mario 3 and world flavored springboard. It's so huge. Alright, see now, now I got that. I can get this one up here! Whoa! Okay, also I can get up here, which is where this is. I heard a one-up sound. Okay, maybe I can use that now to remove the water and I can go up there using the springboard. So you have to do this little detour to get that Mr. Red, which is fine. But if you want to get the key, it's like you beat the level. More things. Okay, I was afraid about that log there. I was like, please don't log me in. I do not give you permission to feed me your delicious log-like cookies. Alright, now we're gonna get down here. Yeah, a single spike. A plant peeking out going bobbly bobbly bob. And I'm like, yeah, you're, you're doing it. Alright, and here's lamb crabs. Crabs that walk on lamb. Very rare. In most places. Other than the place where... Fred Savage pupates. Alright, this is the part where you go from one pipe to another pipe. Whoa, did it. Beat the game. Alright, um... Cannons. Get fire. Uh, Alright. This is a little hide zone here to hide your zone. Please do not share your zone with your co-workers. Alright, I'm gonna sit here and mistime them. Alright, perfect. A beautiful plan in beautiful Holland. Alright, there we go. I have no idea how many red coins I've got. I have not been keeping track. That was probably a mistake, but yeah, when I got that last one, it made a one-up sound, so I hope that means that I got all of them. I, I have no business in believing anything. Can I just flood it and do it on the water? Let's find out. So I don't have to do that mild platforming with all the enemies removed. Uh, yeah, look at that. It's from here. Come on, can I go somewhere I don't understand? Did I need to hit that? I don't know. I don't, I don't think so, but yeah. So you go here. Yeah, this is not flooded. It's outside. You can't flood outside. What a ridiculous notion you're making up here, Jim. Oh, okay. Well. It's a Jellicro surprise! Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Please kill that blooper! Water! 
or lack of destroy all my wet enemies. Oh, you're not destroyed, you're humiliated. So you're destroyed socially, all the same. Uh, well, except you still got to keep living. So, you know, if you have a family or anything, like, they won't be as mad at me. That's how I determine morality. Now I'm somewhere indeed. I'm gonna blow up that thing, maybe. Right, here's a blue switch kind of thing. I don't really know what is going on. Like, why is there two sets of switches? What are you trying to tell me? I got a bomb and I can throw it over there and not do really much of anything. Whoa, I just jumped Ah! Uh, there we go, not good enough. A long one. I didn't, uh, just tell them that. You get like, it's all like water physics. No! This is no good. Eh, alright, 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 okay. <sighs> Alright, boxes. Not stacked up, but they're there. Alright, there's normal coins. There's this guy. Uh-huh. Did I- did I bring them? Yeah, I brought them all! Alright! Wait, you can't replace your shells? Uh, that's just weird. Alright, hey! You got me a f new door. Take the golden star up ahead as well. Alright. There's no music here, and that's scary. All right, I beat the red coin challenge. Okay. Oh boy, the level's not over though. Like things just have to keep going, just a little bit more. All right, here's the thing to the shelter, but there's more goombas and fish. Maybe a bear. Ah, there's a gold star. Fish death. Completely unnecessary. It jumped at me though. I felt threatened. Whew! Okay! <laughs> Man! Alright, that was a hefty level. I mean, there was a lot of exploration. And I explorated a lot. Damn, thundering, breaking turn block. What? Sure, why not? There was some of those. Uh, uh, is it just me? Or like, the further we go, the more people wrote things in the readme. I think it's kind of funny. Yeah. Sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have to be collected in one go. That's fair. I kind of expected that after yesterday. Spiky snail. It's the Shelby. Yeah, and uh, you invented the concept of water. That's. I honestly, I'm pretty happy about that. And then Sinar is involved, and Sturg has things to say. Tempestuous. But you don't get the score for a Sturg point. There is no Sturg point, normal point exchange. It's just too long. It's a long level. So my I played for roughly half an hour, and I didn't die. <laughs> like, like keep that in mind. If I died, it was very early on, and I forgot about it because it was half an hour ago. <laughs> yeah, it's a very backtracky level. It's a, uh, it's pretty linear, but you do retrace your steps often. Swimming, uh, and swim back swimming is pretty fast. Like, there's a part where I could blaze through thing with a power up, and that helps a lot. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, fair enough. Like, again, I feel like my perspective is shaped by my lack of death. <laughs> but see, the thing is, I like having to explore and look for them, but... The best of both worlds, the red coins would be saved on pickup or something. Which is not the author of 10, I mean, that's fine, but you know, just like, just pop, just thinking. Sorry about that. 
Oh no, oh, that hurts though. Yeah, missing one super early on. Oh no. Yeah, level is pretty good, but I think it might have lost points due to the challenge factor. Whoa, is this a romp? It is not a romp though. What? Zatsu, how do you define wrong? This this is a stressful level as heck. Uh, Alright, I mean, from what I understand, Zatsu is not from a platforming background, so there could be a strange use of terminology that doesn't quite fit in definition, and that's fine, but it's good to clear those things up. <laughs> Yeah, respawning enemies that live in blocks is kind of surprising and might get you. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, blowing up the wall there. I don't know, man. I, I. I felt the stress there, but it's just because, yeah, it's at the end, you know, it's the one of the last very dangerous thing you have to engage with. So it looks like it's a good level, but too much level. Like if I just aggregate what all three judges have said and kind of my own feeling, um, <laughs> And didn't make that damn good pun, so you know that. Yeah, that's at least a point loss there. Yeah, I, it's a good level, but it's a lot of level. Sometimes maybe a bit more level than you want. You know, two burgers. Yeah, all day, every day. Five burgers. I might try to sneak out of the room at some point. Don't take it personally. <laughs> 